Hey guys, Matt with CJ Off-Road here. Today in under five minutes, we're gonna be installing a set of these Mopar door sill plates. They're gonna protect the inside part of your door area when you get in and out of your Jeep. Now these sill plates by Mopar feature a nice rubberized design with the Gladiator logo embossed, and these are officially licensed direct from Mopar. They're gonna match the Gladiator logo on the outside of your vehicle and accent the Jeep very well. This kit that I have includes the front and the rear small pieces for the rear door, and these install quickly and easily with the included alcohol wipes and the 3M with the easy peel tabs on the edge. This is literally about a five minute installation. You can get all four of them done and make sure that your Jeep is nice and protected. With that being said, guys, we're gonna go ahead and clean this up a little bit with the included alcohol wipes and get these installed. So we're gonna use the alcohol prep pads that come with it, and we're gonna go ahead and clean all of this section here. You don't need to go out too far. But we'll give this a nice cleaning, and then afterwards, we'll let it sit for about five minutes before we install these. But I'm gonna go ahead and go around and do all four corners, that way we can get this done nice and easy. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and grab the front left side. Now, if you look on the back, there is a side that says molded sill plate front left. Left is going to be the left side, that's left-hand drive. Make sure you look on the back for each of them as they are marked for you. Now, we've let that alcohol sit on there for about five minutes so we can ensure it's completely dry. And what we're gonna go ahead and do, and I really like that Mopar does this, is they give you a little tab to pull the 3M. We're gonna pull the backing on each of the 3M pieces. And then we're gonna line this up. And what I like to do is line the front side up with the indent right here. There's a small indent. We'll go ahead and get that lined up right to the edge of there. Push it towards the back. So it's fully towards the back and then give it firm press all the way down. So right here is the indent. You'll see it actually goes down a little bit and there's about another line an inch and a half to two inches away, but you can feel it and that's where you want the edge to line up. That way it gets a nice flat surface for it to stick on. So for the rear, you're once again gonna look at the back and it'll say the left side, it'll say molded sill plate rear left. So we'll go ahead and pull both of the 3M pieces off of there, set those aside. And then in the rear, it's all flat, so there's no really indent. What I'm gonna do is line up the center of this diamond style pattern to the center of this line here. That way I have a point of reference for the other side to make sure they're on the, they're on the exact same location. So I'm gonna go ahead and push it towards the back of the Jeep, push this in, line that up to the center, and then press firmly all along the 3M, just making sure it properly gets stuck onto there. Same thing for the front. Don't have anyone jump on this for a little bit. Once the 3M's set up, these things are very hard to remove, but you wanna make sure it's set up properly. And according to the instructions, it likes you to do it between 65 and 95 degrees. So if it's super cold outside, the 3M will not stick. Pull this into your garage or wait till the summer or springtime and get that done. Now, that's completely installed. <laughs> this one's not too big, but it definitely will help out from getting that damage. We're gonna go ahead and repeat the same process on the other side, and that'll be it for this one. All right guys, well about five minutes later, we've got these door sill guards properly installed on our 2020 Jeep Gladiator. I gotta say, it's not really that crazy of a technical installation or even that flashy, but these are really gonna protect the inside of your door sills to make sure when you're getting in and out, you're not damaging or scuffing them up. Now these take about five minutes to install for all four of them. You get them done right in your driveway or inside your garage. Just make sure that the temperature is between 65 and 95 so that that 3M adhesive can properly stick. Now these are gonna save your sill plates and make sure that your Jeep stays looking great for a very long time. They're available for the Gladiator, the two-door, and the four-door JL. So if you want to check them out for your vehicle, be sure to visit cjponyparts.com.